there was an old man walking by and uh we're gonna have to title this video he gave me a good title he got me thinking like yeah you know what he's right he was walking he saw me walking by myself and the og said yeah this is a uh, one-man operation <laughs> and you know what i just realized where is my team so we are here all right nice place though nice place Right, so I got the bouncer right here. I'm gonna go get the uh, the rest of the stuff so I can set it up right here. So we're trying to get the tarps, stash core, and blow.
this one. I'm gonna roll out. Keys are ready. They got the chairs already. They got the chairs ready outside. So the grown-ups can watch the keys play. I already made sure everything's secure, the stakes, uh, the zippers. I like to double check my work, guys. It's very important, safety first. All right, everything looks good. Also, guys, shout out to Courtney. He gave me a good tip. Uh, these straps right here, the ones that are uh, to tight the bouncer when you roll it up. Now I use them for uh, right here just to secure these uh, air pockets. So it comes on handy instead of just having them, you know, under the bouncer. We put them, we put them for use now. So everything is tight. All right, everything good. Everything good. We got the cone. Let me check this uh, air pocket right here. All right, let's go. Uh, everything good now. One thing about me, I double check, guys. I ain't taking no time. But uh, this one right here, guys, has to be picked up today, tonight, because it's in an apartment complex. So if it's going to the backyard, I let the, I let uh, I let them keep it overnight. But this one I'm gonna have to come back later after their uh, six hours is up. But most of the time, since it gets dark real quick, most of the time. Uh, they only use like four hours so that's pretty cool all right let me wrap it up guys so we can roll out all right guys the doll is already strapped up and here's the last cone now guys there was an old man walking by and uh <laughs> we're gonna have to title this video he gave me a good title he got me thinking like yeah right he was walking he saw me walking by myself and the OG said yeah this is a uh, one-man operation <laughs> and you know what I just realized where is my team lately I've been working by myself guys and y'all seen the videos most of the time I'm just working by myself especially with the bounce house business and uh well mainly with the detailing uh the detailing uh I just can't find a good detail, uh, somebody who likes the detail. Just, I can't find nobody who really likes, uh, who has the passion to detail cars. Um, so, we'll, we'll talk about this in a minute, guys. But yeah, we're gonna name this video, guys, a One Man Operation. OG just gave me a good title. Now, he, uh, I don't know where he went, but he was walking by. This is a pretty day, too, guys. It's not, it's not too cold. But people are putting excuses not not to work. You know, I, I'm not gonna force anybody to work. Um, but you know, um, I'm, I always get a door open for uh, for anybody. You know, I always get an op opportunity. If you want to make some money, just come help me out. You know, you know. One thing about me, I'm not greedy. You know, I'll pay you, and we'll find some more work. Why? Let's let's just stay busy. Uh, I do get tired most of the time when I'm by myself, but hey, I gotta make it happen. The customer wants uh, a bouncer. I gotta make it happen, guys. This is a business. This is not no, no, oh, I, I don't feel like doing it today, so I'm just gonna cancel. I, I take this business serious, guys. I take it serious. But let me go inside the truck. I'm gonna talk to y'all about that, all right? Yeah, guys, well, this is the one man operation, guys. As y'all can see, I'm making it happen by, by myself. And uh, it is where it is. You know, the customer needs a bouncer. I'm not going to cancel. I'm going to make it happen. Somehow, I'm going to find my way. I'm going to make it happen. Uh, the game plan, guys, uh, is that I do have to get find somebody who really wants to 
work, who is dedicated, who is really serious about working in, in, in this business or uh, the bounce house business. Because once we get into the busy season, I don't want to be looking for somebody last minute. So I need to find somebody, train them. Right now is a good time to train somebody and uh, let, let them know, hey, look, this is how uh, the whole operation works. Um, so that's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to be looking for somebody. And uh, they, hopefully he or she can come over here, help me out. And uh, they, so it, it, this, this job right here is so simple, guys. You can get the hang of it like real quick. It doesn't take that long to, to get the hang of it. Uh, Y'all remember Nathan, the, uh, the, uh, the, the guy that used to help me out. He got the hang of it real quick. Now, if you if y'all asking about Nathan, guys, um, uh, I got in touch with him. Well, he actually got in touch with me. He uh, he called me last month, and um, he missed work. He missed two weekends, guys. Uh, he woke up late. Now I understand, guys. Look, he's a teenager, guys. You know, he, he don't have big responsibilities like us, guys. So, you know, he still stay with his mom. He ain't got no bills. I understand. He's a teenager, you know. But uh, he's a good worker. That's a good thing. He's a, he's a good worker. He works. You tell him what to do. And most of the time, I don't even have to tell him what to do. You know, he gets to it. And that's what I like. You know, I don't have to tell him what to do. But, uh... I'll have a door open for him if you do want to, want to come back, but I do have to find somebody who is, who 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 wants to work. You know, uh, most of the people that that help me out, they just uh, I can't force nobody, guys. I can't force a grown person to work, and then they settle for less. So if they get paid a hundred dollars for that day, for the job they did, for if they did bouncers or they did detailing, they don't want to show up the next day. They just settle for less. They just, they think a hundred dollars that's that's gonna take care of them the whole week. I mean, I used to make at the warehouse. I used to make five hundred dollars a week. That's just without the overtime. And and people just want to settle for a hundred dollars a week. Come on, that's nothing, guys. That's nothing, guys. Especially if you got bills. Mm. Mm -mm. But. I try to motivate people, guys, People, especially the people that are around me, but they don't have the motivation. I try to tell them, hey, look, if you make this type of money, you can buy whatever you want. You can you can move out of your mom's house and get your own place and, and all that. Mm -mm. They just want to smoke, drink, chill, be broke, complain they're broke again. Come on. It doesn't work that way. Mm. But one thing I learned is, guys, my uh, my boss, well, my boss, yeah, a long time ago at the warehouse told us, this is what he said, you can't force a grown man what to do. Mm -mm. You can't force a grown man what to do. All right? So this is a one-man operation right now, guys. We are uh, working into finding someone else to work. So I'll be hiring. Because we uh, got to find somebody to help me out the thing is guys i can make this happen right now i can make it happen guys y'all see me do it do it you know i'm uh in, do the bounce ball myself pick them up by myself and um i make it look easy in the videos but once i get back home guys my body be tired and i'm not young like i used to you know what i'm saying so i do get tired but especially on the uh, busy season and with the heat Oh, yeah, I'm going to need some help, guys, for real. But right now, I can handle it. But uh, that's why I got to get somebody that, you know, wants to work. All right. Well, this is some one man operation, guys, and I'll see you on the next video. Let's keep grinding. Let's get it.